pretty good. I was ready to like get the rubber band, cut off the circulation to my head. So yes, I'm going on a date today. We're going to the movie theaters and then we're gonna eat after, which I think is cute. Yeah, but she literally has no idea what we're doing because I texted her yesterday and was like, what are you doing tomorrow? Let me take you out. <laughs> then she was like, oh, I'm spending the day with my boyfriend. I was like, no, you're not. I'll be there to pick you up at 1230. I think you should take your friends on dates. There was some stuff that I was gonna do by myself because I have no problem going by myself, but I also realized that I'm coming up on a season in my life where I know things are gonna get hectic and I might not have enough time to see her. So I was like, instead of going by yourself, why don't you take her with you? upset because I just realized that doing my foundation lifted up the lace in the front just a little bit but uh, I'm really excited I haven't seen this friend in a while the last time I saw her last time I saw her I still had tape on my nose that's how long it's been I don't know if she was fishing for answers but she was like what should I wear and I was like well Bring a sweater and don't eat that much. Cause the movie theater is always cold and I wanted to see a thousand to one or a thousand and one, um, the new movie with Tiana Taylor. I know I'm going to probably bawl my eyes out. The trailer got me like all choked up. So I can't even imagine what the movie's gonna be like. We are gonna go eat after, or I mean, I guess that's up to her. I told her not to eat too much. Um, we can enjoy popcorn in the movie theater, but I kind of wanted to go have maybe like lunch somewhere since it is pretty early. Right now it's 10.47. I need to be in the car physically at 12 o'clock. I think I'm making good time because I'm like halfway through the base of my makeup. I'm not doing too, too much. I wanna keep it pretty natural today. <laughs> not natural, just like pretty simple makeup. Still kind of have to fix my hair, but I think I wanna save that for last. And I still have to pick out my outfit. I have no idea what I'm wearing. I know it needs to be warm, because if I told her to bring a sweater, I'm gonna need a coat. I'm low-key trying to recreate a look I did not too long ago. This one. Oh my god, what time is it? Oh, it's only 10.57. Why am I tripping? No, I... I don't know. I don't think anybody notices this except for me. Probably can't even see it on the camera. It probably doesn't really add much, but I'll know. Looks like no eyeliner was added. I need some new lip gloss, but there's so many good ones out right now. I don't know which one to get next. I think this is the final look. I'm so tempted to darken it up a little bit with like um, some eye, like inner eyeliner or like a beauty mark, but I think I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna restrain myself. I miss the drama. Okay, and now I need to go back and fix this stupid. Do you see it's lifting right here? Come on now. No more lifting and don't worry about these side pieces because the hair is going to cover that. Okay, it's 11.08. We have one hour to get dressed and fix this hair. Ooh. You know, now that I repeated the whole makeup, I'm tempted to repeat that whole outfit because I remember what I wore. But you know what? The movie theater is too cold for what I wore because I was wearing a very tiny dress. I think I need to wear pants, even though it's insanely hot outside. Hey Siri, what's the temperature outside? It's about 84 degrees outside. It's so hot outside, but it's so cold in the movie theater. I think I'm gonna wear these. I don't know why, I'm just feeling 
drawn to them. I need something warm, but not warm. Maybe I'll wear a long skirt. Something like this could be cute. Very long. I'm technically covered, but it's very sheer so that I won't get too hot. But if I wear this, I don't know if I'll be able to wear those boots. Yeah, if I wear this skirt, I cannot wear these boots. So these boots are out. That was fast. I feel like I should wear a sandal with these, but then my feet will be so cold. <gasps> the ballet flats, yes! I'm gonna wear the Mew Mews. How cute are these? Okay, I already know that these are gonna work and I don't like to wear shoes in the house, so I'm just gonna leave them by the door. And then for the top, for the top, I need to wear something that can be worn with a sweater because I'm bringing a sweater for sure. What about this one? This one's cute. Raspberry Sherbert sweater and the sleeves are so long. As long as I'm not wearing like a crop top underneath, like too cropped, it should be fine. But do we wanna go pink? I also have this sweater. This one's so cute. Ties up in the front like that. I'll definitely be warm. I think I'm gonna leave both out and then I will pick, I gotta pick the undershirt. Okay, I could wear this. This tank top is absolutely fine. And then I wear this sweater on top. Is this too much? I love this sweater so much. Or I could do like an all black look with a pop of color. So I have this black velvet shirt, which I feel like makes it more like a date outfit just because of the texture. And then this purple sweater. I thought I was gonna like this version better, but I think I like what I had on earlier. Okay, this shirt is a bit wrinkly. Like honestly, it could be, it could stand to go through the dryer and get shrunk just a little bit, but whatever. Yeah, this is the one. It's way too hot to wear this now or anywhere but the theater, so I'm just gonna leave this to the side and let's pick out some jewelry. Definitely wanna wear this ring for sure. This bracelet would be cute. And then a little necklace. I think this one's good. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot earrings. I will wear, I wanna wear something small. Probably not gonna see them, I'll wear these. These two little strips will cover up the little imperfections that I have. I mean, to, you know what? This wig looks really good and I don't think I have to do much to it just because it's been on the wig head since the last time I styled it. So it hasn't been smushed or anything. I will define did I cut this wig? I think I did. I was gonna say, there are some like really nice layers in it. Yeah, I did that. <laughs> okay, what do you guys think? Are we done? I think this looks pretty good. Where's my other mirror? I need to check the back of my head. Okay, the back looks really good. I just wanted to curl the ends more. Oh my gosh, so much of my hair gets caught in this flower. Okay, focus, what time is it? 11.48, I see, I don't know how people are like, oh, I have 20 minutes to get ready, get ready with me, because I best believe if I have 20 minutes to get ready, I'm not pulling out a camera. There's absolutely no way. I hope it looks good, I'm gonna check it one more time in the back and probably move on for now because I, Completely forgot that I had to pack a bag. Should I wear the silver one? That would be cute, right? Sunglasses. Okay, well I'm wearing black, so it's gotta be either of these two. I know I'm wearing silver jewelry, but bear with me. These, which I'm really leaning towards, or these. <sighs> these win every single time. My other sunglasses are begging me to take them out for a spin. Okay, this is the outfit of the day, what it looks like all put together. 
You can't really see much on the feet, but you know. I think I'm gonna leave the sweater open because it's giving like a, I don't know, it's just giving a vibe. I like it open. I don't think I'm gonna tie it up because then this is how it would look tied. Yeah, no, leave it open. And then this is the bag. The sweater's from the Ragged Priest. The top, I think I found it in like a really random shop in Wynwood. I can't remember the name. The skirt is vintage and the shoes are Miu Miu. That's my alarm. I have to go. Bye. There she is. There's my baby. not the day that I went on the date but yeah it's actually two days later you know how it is when you get with your friends like you know you're with a really good friend when you don't answer your phone don't check your text messages don't pick up the vlog camera and that's exactly how it was um, but yeah we had a great time the movie was really good Ugh, the subtle like nuances of you know what, I don't even want to say it because I don't want to spoil it for anyone who's planning to go see it, but if you want to go see it, go see it. I will say I did not cry. I thought I was going to like bawl my eyes out, um, but I actually like that they didn't make it too, too heavy because I'm tired of black pain. <laughs> we ended up coming back to my place, which I wouldn't suggest for like a real date, but obviously this is my friend. She's been at my house several times before. Yeah, and then we ended up talking for so long, which I love. I love my quality time. That's my love language. And speaking of quality time, thank you guys so much for hanging out. Bye.